Thank you. Thank you. Fueled up, baby. Oh, it's a little chilly out here this morning. A little cold. The Arctic Arizona winters. Oh, but it's gonna be a nice day. We just talked to the briefer. Clear in a million going into San Diego. He lies. Well, the marine layer. But uh, Taff has it burning off by the time we get there. So it'll be like scattered at a thousand and uh, broken at 20,000. So we should be good. Nice day to fly to San Diego, get some brunch, and then continue up to Santa Barbara. Check, 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 check. I got you. Hold on. Yeah, so just. It's sets are on, avionics is on, comms, uh, you can 2832 on two, get the eight. 3004. Visual approaching you, signing and departing, runways four left and right. Notice this airman, helipad, Pappy out of service. BFR departures, advise ground control direction of flight. Advise on initial contact, you have Foxtrot. Foxtrot. Chandler Tower information, Foxtrot, 1247 Zulu, 10. Chandler ground, Skyhawk 65453, spot 505 with Foxtrot, ready to copy IFR clearance to San Diego. So six five four five three channel ground clearance on request. Clearance on request four five three. And we'll book. So six five four five three right, clearance available. And ready to copy clearance Skyhawk four five three. Skyhawk four five three clear to San Diego Airport via radar vectors Gila band on us filed. Maintain three thousand. Expect eight thousand three minutes after departure. Departure frequency one two three point seven squawk zero seven six three. Clear to the San Diego airport via radar vectors. Gila Bend then is filed. 3,000, expect 8,000. Uh, frequency 123.7, squawk 0763 for Skyhawk 453. Skyhawk 453, expect 8,000. Three minutes after departure, rest or read back, correct. 8,000 in three minutes, and thanks for the help, 453. Guys, if you can hear us, welcome to the audio recording of the YouTube video. I hope this works. It'd be pretty cool for you to hear the ground flight. station air two four zero on the TVN. Turn and left, getting right. Five, three, follow check. King Air to your left on Alpha. Follow King Air to our left on Alpha. Scott four five three. All right, we'll hold here before Juliet. Wait for this King Air to our left. There goes the King Air. Clear left, going right four left via Alpha. Listen, Charcraft and Russian Golf Car and altimeter 3007. 3007 set. Radar vectors out of here to 3000. Off to Gila Bend. Alright, so she just tower. Appreciate it, and you can set 237 in there for departure. Alright, thank you. Alright, parking brakes coming on. My feet are on the brakes. I'll grab that checklist from you real quick. Thank you. Taxi checklist is complete. Run up checks. Enunciator panels good. Mixtures full rich. Throttle coming to 1800 RPM. Both over to left. About a 40 RPM drop back to both. Two clicks to the right. About 60 RPM drop, no more than 150 each. Back to both, looking good. I'll let the oil temperature warm up. It's almost in the green Looks now. Like it's there for yeah, it's pretty good. Circuit breakers are all in. Engine instruments are looking good. Suction gauge is in the green. Throttle idle. Here to Charlie Tango, frequency change proof. Idling around 500 RPM. Stable, back to 1,000. And make sure we'll re leave a full rich. It's cooler out today for takeoff. All right, field elevation is roughly 1,200 feet, which means our turn back altitude would be 2,200 feet. That's 1,000 AGL. If we were to have any issues off the runway below that 2,200 altitude, uh, we'd pitch for 68 knots, best glide speed within 30 degrees of the nose, land most likely on the 202 highway or a road out there, find something uh, for above 2,200 feet are on uh, four left, we'll make a right turn back to two two right above that altitude, uh, declare an emergency, do our thing. Uh, and if we were to have any abnormalities, 
Uh, you or I could call a board on the takeoff roll. We'll idle the throttle, stop straight ahead, secure the airplane, get out, and uh, solve the issue as needed. Five, four, four, runway four right, clear, touching go. Right, this is, uh, four right, five, fuel enunciator's kind of acting up a little bit. Which one? The right side. The gauge is just doing its little flicker thing, but it should be fine. Should stable once you burn off some fuel. Are you gonna show the people that what what kind of? What's that? What kind of takeoff? What kind of do? takeoff we're we gonna do? We could do a short field takeoff for the people. You want to see a short field takeoff, guys? We'll uh, do a short field takeoff. Flaps set flaps ten. 10. Cool. We're gonna set flaps ten here. We're gonna use all of the available runway. We're gonna go full throttle. Hold the brakes. Make sure our RPM is set somewhere. Probably 2,300 RPMs is what we'll see. Release the brakes. Look for our rotation speed of 55. Climb out at 62 VX until we clear our 50-foot obstacle. Transition to VY 74, and then go flaps up and keep on moving and grooving, and uh, go where ATC tells us to. So pre-takeoff brief is complete. Flight controls. I'll give a wipe out. Look good. Rudder checks. Flight instruments are checked and set. We're on GPS. I've got the runway heading bug currently up to 3,000 is our initial altitude. Uh, autopilot is off and inoperative. Fuel gauges are full, we've checked that. Fuel selectors on both. Trim is set for takeoff. Heading indicator set to runway for now. We've briefed the departure initial altitude and uh, mixtures full rich. Engine instruments are set green. Oil, temp oil temperatures come up. X. Seat belts are good, you're belted in. Doors are secure. Uh, landing light and strobe light will come on on the runway as we're cleared for takeoff. Transponder is altitude 0763. Checks. Looks looks good to me, man. For takeoff, checklist is complete. Four left. 453, turn left heading 220, runway 4 left, clear for takeoff. Left heading 220, clear for takeoff, runway 4 left, Skyhawk 453. Take kilo mic, channel tower, hold short of runway 4 left. All right, we'll parking brakes coming off. Landing strobe coming on. Flaps are set 10. Yeah, four, four, be full stop this time around. This is 544, Roger. Use all of the available runway here. Clear left, five, runway four, clear four, right. Make left traffic, runway 4 left. left Finals left, clear. Left, five, four, four. Thank you, sir. And here we go, here's the brakes. Full power. RPMs are made, about 2100, here we go. Airspeed's alive, 55, rotate. Climb out at 62. Just a 544, four, there'll be one Baron departing prior to your arrival. 544, four, understood. Love our 50 foot obstacle will transition to VY. Let the airspeed climb. Turn a kilo mic, fly straight out, Tra assess the traffic ops. And All right, what's up, folks? Uh, we're coming in here to San Diego. We just got a vector for the localizer 27. Clear Zulu, runway 27 approach. Clear the RNAV Zulu, runway 27 approach, southwest at 2500. So we're currently heading 290, descending from 8,000 to 7,000. Uh, it's uh, forecasted 1,400 broken at San Diego International. It'll be pretty cool. We'll get to pop through the marine layer uh, yeah, right. for you guys. And, um, yeah. John 505 Heavy, contact tower 118.3. You localizer 27. John 505 Heavy, you do see Alaska 720, maintain 180 knots, or greater to Rebo. I've got the controls. Greater to Rebo, Alaska 720. Alex, I'm going to get the controls. Speed to 180 and maintain 180 knots, or greater. And you've got controls. All right, guys, so we're descending down to 7,000. We've had to send right up. You want to maintain 12,000. We have at least 500. Okay, I'll approach. 300, 0 heading. Runway 27. Vectors for the localizer 27. You might be able to see the vector for the localizer 27. You might be able to see that fog layer out there over San Diego. Alaska 720, caution break turbulence. You are 6 miles. We've got 110.9, the localizer frequency 2 in 1. 118.3. 6.45 on number two, which is the PGY, 
EOR frequency. And this should be a cool little approach. I'll get the uh, handheld camera, get a couple different angles for you guys, and fly into San Diego International in a 172. Right, direct. Cessna 453, five miles from Rebo, turn right, heading 240, maintain 3,800, cell established, clear localizer, runway 27 approach. Heading 240, 3,800 until established, clear for the localizer, 27 approach, Skyhawk 453. Skyhawk 453, maintain your best speed. Speed as possible, we appreciate you getting us in. Southwest, uh, Better above 2,000, we're on a 172, no worries. <laughs> yeah, we'll be good. Dropping altitude is not a problem. Cessna 453, contact tower, 118.3. 183, have a good day, 453. Southwest 2246, contact SoCal departure, good day. Switch parks along, Southwest 2246. San Diego Tower, Skyhawk 65453 with you, localizer 27. Skyhawk 65453, Lumber Tower, runway 27, clear to land, winds 360 at 3. Runway 27, clear to land, Skyhawk 453. All right. Southwest 987, Lumber Tower. 987, go ahead. Southwest 987, Travis, Cessna, 3.5 mile final, runway 27, cleared for takeoff without delay. Clear for takeoff without delay, Southwest 987. And we have crossed, so we can descend to our minimum. Good morning, good morning. Southwest 1496, Lumber Tower, traffic inside a five mile final. Traffic will hold in position, runway 27, clear to land, wind calm. 27, clear to land, Southwest 1496. Yeah, beautiful. Now 453, uh, previous arrival broke out around 1,000 feet on final. Roger, thanks. Runway inside, 453. Thank you. Alright, pretty high. Alright, you can go ahead and start configuring. Hold the power. Good. Southwest 987, contact SoCal departure. Southwest 987. There we go, under one. The old dump and slow, baby. Wind check variable at four. Well, slip. Low at 85. Alaska 895, Lumber Tower traffic approaching a five mile final, runway 27, line up and wait. Line up way 27, Alaska 895. Here we go. Charlie five. Cessna four five three turn right. Next intersection, Charlie five. Continue on to Charlie without delay and call grounds on one two three point nine. Charlie five, Charlie without delay, twenty three nine, and uh, we're going to signature. Thanks. Okay, so twenty four nine three nine miles out for runway two. Alaska eight ninety five runway two seven. Got your lights off. Ground Skyhawk six five four five three Charlie five Charlie taxing to signature. Sky 65453, five, Limburg, contact you to the Ramp Beach Charlie Hotel. Charlie Hotel to the Ramp Sky 453. Yeah, I'll be follow this to the right. All right, folks, welcome to San Diego. We put that down. I put that down. Put it down a little firm there, that's yeah. okay. He needed some left rudder. Alex is getting used to the right seat. He's trying to do his commercial from the right seat, so you don't even have that. You probably have like less than 10 hours right seat time, so. Still getting used to it. That approach is beautiful there, right? Yeah. Right by the city? Yeah, coming in. The old whip around. Around, yeah. Yeah, just 180 to your right. Alright, Alaska 1143, push back, uh, G26, Unicorn. Alaska 1143, Lumber Gun, push your discretion. Push your discretion, Alaska 1143. Yeah. Oh, cut it. Alright folks, we made it to San Diego.
So what's up ladies and gentlemen? Oh, flying to San Diego in the 172. Grab the crew car, off to some breakfast, get a little brunch. Probably gonna go to Seaport Village, get a little brunch on the water, and then uh, head up the coastline uh, past LA, Malibu to Santa Barbara, baby. Let's go.